Hello, I'm John Joel Regan. You're watching Fighters Only TV. We're here in Birmingham, England, with the one and only Mark Munoz, who's come all the way from California, King's MMA to Seals. Mark, thanks for joining us. How are you doing? Um, great. Um, I don't think I'm the one and the only because there's a lot of Mark Munozes, but I am the one and only Filipino wrecking machine. So, um, so yeah. So just in, in response to that. Is there really a lot of Mark Munozes? Yeah, man. I, I, I search for Mark Munoz and there's like so many of them. And I'm like, man, I want markmunoz.com. You know, someone has it. And it's an artist. And I'm like, man, I'm going to take that from you. But I can't. <laughs> um, I think you've just given away there that you sit there Googling yourself. Yeah. You search for yourself a lot online? No, well, no, I was trying to, I was trying to find markmunoz.com. This is earlier in my career. And then when I searched for that, there was like so many Mark Munozes. And I'm like, where are these all people all at? You know, and so there's, there's a Filipino, there's Filipino Mark Munozes, there's Spanish Mark Munozes, Mexican Mark Munozes. I don't know if there's like Brazilians maybe, but there's like so many Mark Munozes, man. So, so, um, so I wouldn't know if I'm the one and only, there's a lot, but I'm the, I am the one and only Mark, the Filipino record machine Munoz. Well, you're the only Mark Munoz that we care about and go. that these people care about. Go, so, go. yeah. Fighter um, only cares about me. That's awesome. Oh, we love you. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Uh, this Saturday, you're fighting Chris Lieben. Yes, I am fighting Chris Lieben. This yeah. is true. Uh, tough guy, big swinger, yeah. likes to move forward. And uh, Chris was just speaking here a moment ago. And Chris said that stylistically, a lot of people think he wouldn't like the fight because you're a wrestler, takedown game. But he yeah. said, no, actually, I like it because Mark Munoz doesn't know how to fight moving backwards. <laughs> That's right. I don't know how to fight moving backwards. So you're going to see two Rams going at it. So... We'll see he'll be moving backwards, you know. So, um, you know, I mean, that's, it's great, you know, for him to say that because I know that he's going to move forward, you know. <laughs> so, but, you know, for me, like, it's going to be a great fight, you know. I, I, don't, I don't look to, like, pity patter or, like, do that sort of thing, you know. I look to land bombs, and that's what I do, and that's what I do best, and that's who I am, and that's what's going to happen. And um, people are going to love it, you know, and people are going to see fireworks just like on bonfire night. You know, it's going to be fireworks tonight. Chris's best weapon, in your opinion? His left hand. My best weapon is my right hand. So <laughs> we'll see who's going to land. See, I was thinking, um, how can I put this nicely? You fought Damien Meyer, right? Yes. Damien's a jiu-jitsu guy, but he's been working heavily on his stand-up. Yeah. And in round one, Damien caught you with that left hand, really staggered you. Yeah, man. Yeah, so I'm thinking free. Chris has got a real left hand as well, like he's kind of a... Yeah, yeah. Mm. You're stirring the pot here, I'm huh? Not, I'm not stirring the pot. You're man. You're stirring it. But you know what? He come in a weird place, man. It was in the back of my head. Yeah. And you've seen a lot of people get hit in the back of the head and um, not recover from it, you know? And uh, it was weird, man, because he hit me, and I was like, I'm fine whoa what went on there you know but then he hit me a lot of times on the on the jaw you know but after that i mean before that and after i took it and i and i sent him back and he hit he did a he did a plie you know i made him do ballet in there you know so um so yeah i, I have confidence in my chin you know for sure and uh you saw my fight against kendall grove where he got me in the uppercut came back end up finishing him he caught me with the knee too so when you talk about when you talk about resilience i have resilience when you talk about a great chin i have a great chin but at the same time who wants to get hit nobody except for chris levin he loves getting hit and coming back and knocking people out you know so i'm excited man it's gonna be a great fight